Greetings from the Bob Show. We are in a time of social distancing. So we have our Zoom stuff going on here and we have contacted our awesome reading friend, Mrs. Leslie Brennan, who is a teacher at Pat Henry and knows the value of a good book. Leslie Brennan, welcome to the Bob Show. Thank you, Bob. It's nice to finally meet you. I've been waiting and um, it's very exciting to get to, to meet you. I, I wish it was in person, but, but I will definitely take this. Well, we all got to do what we got to do during these interesting times. You are right. You are right. And I am also excited to meet you and hear about how you love to read. Can you tell us about your love of reading books? I really enjoy reading, Bob. Um, I was very blessed to have a mom who also loves reading. And so she modeled that for me from a very young age. So I was able to um, I learned to read at a, at a young age, and my mom encouraged that by, um, when I was in elementary school, she had me in a, a book club. So every month I would get two new books, and couldn't wait to get my two new books, very excited. And so it just fed that, that love for reading, and, and I've, I've always enjoyed getting lost in a good story. Two books every month? That's awesome! Do you remember any of your favorite ones? Yes, I do. Socks by Beverly Cleary was probably my all-time favorite. I would read that one over and over and over again. Of course, I'm also a cat person, so that that's probably one of the reasons why I like that one so much. Yeah. Um, and from my understanding, your first guest and I um, have a mutual liking for the Encyclopedia Brown books. So Mr. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, and what I liked about Encyclopedia Brown was how much I learned, and I still remember things that I learned from the Encyclopedia Brown books, which I think is kind of funny. Tell us something you remember from Encyclopedia the Man. Okay, so, you know, it's raining right now. I don't know if you can tell that, Bob, in your studio, and there's been thunder and lightning, and one thing, in one of his cases, someone tried to say that um, thunder woke woke him up and then he saw somebody in the lightning because the lightning flashed and stuff and Encyclopedia Brown was able to tell him that couldn't happen because the lightning cracks and then the thunder happens and so um I thought that was pretty interesting and now another favorite author that I had when I was in school was Judy Bloom. I, I really enjoyed reading through all her books learned a lot she she tended to write about what you know, different phases of kids' lives, what they might be going through and, and different situations. And, and so I, I enjoyed reading her books as well. Another classic, great choices. Any last words for our viewing audience today? I would just say um, that if you get to watch this video and we're still in this social distancing, take the time to grab a few great books and, and, and escape into a wonderful story. Absolutely couldn't have said it better myself. For the Blob Show, Miss Leslie Brennan. Talk to you later, everybody. Bye. Bye.